But no, no, it was just a micro bore. In fact, Minimo's like the only person who even noticed. Oh yeah, that's a nice gain on the healing. It used to be 50%, uh, 50, now it's 80. <clears throat> that is much Wilbur. <laughs> Fucking Wilbur. Won't open. What's this? Turn the Minimo to Uchi. Set to Uchi. Well, S is missing from that, and... Is this it? And S is wrong in that. Weird. What's this? Seabird's nest. Must be old. No birds. Okay, we'll finish clearing the hall instead. Is this it? Printed out email and a key inside. Oh, we got a small key. Another door. Found it. Piece of the strategy guide for the game Reckless Skies. Saying that was a trap triggering. I heard the squeal, but I didn't see anything. I was starting to wonder if there was a really weird trap going on or what. Is this it? Seabird's nest. Found it. A stuffed pig doll. And some stairs. Okay, well, let's kind of finish clearing this out before we uh, mess with the stairs at all. Time to check the map. Just mark that one so I remember which one's the new set. What's this? Offer the goats white blessing. Okay, so I gotta put something up there. Is that a hole? That looks like a hole. Well, that's a hole and a fat dude. Ah. Bye bye. Okay, let's uh, go around through the other door instead. Stuff big in the darkness. <laughs> oh. I need a bore out of darkness t-shirt. Uh, Thanks to this game. Found it. Inventory forms for company supplies. Is this it? Offer a speck of the sea. Not speck of the sea enough. I'll hold it. Flawless AI. Well, the problem is now I have to deal with it down there and I don't know where it is down there, as opposed to up here where I knew where it was. Similarly again. What's this? Hospitality manual. Shows how to deal with nasty customers. Found it. Offer the ripened red fruit. Uh, man, they're all just collecting down there. This is not good. I don't want to go downstairs anymore. Guys, like I should have started at this end. What's this? Detailed cleaning manual for the ship's interior. I found it. Offer the child of the one with two heads. Hmm. Well, I mean, ripe red fruit, we do have that one properly ripened tomato that I didn't end up feeding to anyone. We yeah, have those two fat guys and pig down there? Yeah, the pig, not a problem. The fat guy's less keen on. Yeah, if we can actually keep people reasonably synced like this, when everyone gets old, we'll just go back, rest and bond to death, and then when they're kids, we'll rest and bond until they're adults. God. Okay. Let's 
a lot of, uh, what the? Well, that's a thing. Waiting for my chance. They won't get away. No more it doesn't seem to care. Yep. It does not care. Whatever the hell it is, I don't like it. I'll take it. Lucky sea me. beast meat. Should it care? Well, most of the time, electricity seems like a good thing for me to make use of to kill other things. Apparently not here. God, no, I can't even trust being near the water. A letter that washed up. Too wrinkled to read. Hmm. <clears throat> okay. I wonder if there's enough room for me to kind of juke through that. Dangerous areas can be forts when fighting enemies. The, the problem there is, yes, I could stand in the middle of all that electricity. However, I also wouldn't be able to two-step out of the way of anything trying to kill me. I'm pretty sure they'd win the fight. What are you talking? Shut up, Raypar. I hear movement. I don't like the sound of movement in the darkness. Oh, oh, there. Oh, God, there was the fat guy, too. Go there. Oh, man, come on. Come on. Come over this way. Come my way. Okay, I see other stuff moving in the dark. This place is horrifying! Oh good, lightning does nothing to them either. No more messing around! Waiting for my chance! They won't get away! That tongue. No more messing around. Yeah. Victor, go the spoils. Okay, well, one fat man done. I am moving in darkness. I think boars. I'm not sure these things of the boars are worse. Well, at least these things come out of the darkness slowly, as opposed to the boars, who just, yeah. I kind of want to get electrocuted to just get an idea of how much damage it is, whether or not I really have to be careful about getting across or not. Now, if I can get just the beast. They won't come. Oh, he's got a separate breakable part. No more messing around! Wait a At least this way, he doesn't have to be able to move for the job to work. Oh, hey, these guys drop air bladders. Good. Ready? 
waiting now. They won't get away. No more break. They won't get away. No more break. Cost me a little bit more stamina, but I want to get that bit off his back. How do you suppose he actually hits? I mean, I could get hit and find out. I have a sneaking suspicion I wouldn't like it. Let's take this. We need this, right? Well, the air bladders are a good find at least. Given the size of it hard. Well, you never know, right? You never know for sure until you actually just nut up and get your face bitten off. So there's still a rabbit and a fat dude down here for sure. I feel weird calling it that, but that's what it was called when it killed one of us. Wait. Pretty sure I heard movement. Let's take this. Never sure if a lone water bottle is the game going, well, you know, you probably only need one because everyone just pissed themselves, or, look, an item. How about you come get it? No. No, I don't want to. I'll hold it. We need this, right? I do not trust being down here. Hey, Hardcore Casual, how's it going? This is, uh, honestly, this is a contender for my game of the year. I have had an enormous amount of fun with it. Well, well. Definitely still hearing movement. Ooh, okay, I think we got the shock stuff off. Okay, but not this one. Maybe there's a separate button somewhere around this one. Well, something to look for another time. Let's check the map. You know, this game needs flashlights. I don't disagree. Oh. They won't get away. No more messing around. Waiting for my <laughs> Screw this thing. <laughs> Waiting for my chance. They won't get <laughs> What are you doing? Shit. Shit. I... Well, now we know what it's called. I misclicked and I turned instead of strafing. Sometimes I wonder if I should actually... Oh, shit. There's the other fat man. Well, that complicates things a tiny bit, doesn't it? All right, Rio, you're up. Oh god, none of you are really quite sufficiently tanky. Uh, you're in, but... Uh, okay then. Fat man out of darkness. Good times. What is it? I'll take it! Seems very confused. I'm okay with this. Ready? No more messing around. Careful. Get that tongue. Oh, that did not get the tongue. Ready? No more messing around. Now get the tongue? Yeah, they're actually creepier without it. Yeah. Does this look useful? Okay. Let's just uh Got it. Does this gather look everything up. Let's go a little bit. Got it. Let's go. 
Well, good on Minamo for still being standing after that. Trade things around so we got the best gear. Oh, I was going to say, I think I hear something. No more messing around. Ready? Ready? Yeah. This. Yeah. 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 Got it. Okay. Bloody need to run. Oh, God, it kind of does look like one. Huh. All right. Well, I'm glad I at least heard that one coming. We get caught in our inventory. All right, everybody's geared up. You two get mule gear. Uh, Minimo hates that stuff. Uh, let's give her rabbits. Thanks. I ate it in one bite. Let's give Sacha get some that? rabbit as well. Not bad at all. There we go. He has covered as well. Such a good too. has got the better heals, so. A lot of corruption fast, though. Got kind of amazed at how well Sachiko can take the uh, corruption at this point. All right, now that people are properly kitted, who's actually got the defense? 13779, 1695, 13499. Okay, Minamo and Rinko get frontline. Oh, I thought I heard something. People learning, but getting XP, Got but it. not not Haruto, not Zen. I'll take it. Does this look useful? What is it? Oh man, just to go one shot with resistance and the highest difficulty. Uh, if they were the same attack, so you've got the greatly reduced from that creature and the attack. No, if your gear is kind of reasonably up to par. If you've got decent gear and both the resistances for what's uh, tagging you, you usually do pretty reasonable. Do they just keep coming? No more messing around. Ready? It seems confused. I'm moving around a lot, so I'm not going to go for charge attacks on it. Too much stamina consumption if I do that. Got it. All right, we're getting lots of air bladders at least. And that'll give us a few options when we get back. Got it. Got a hammer. Okay. Lizard sheddings. Yum. I'm sure we'll find a use. I definitely still hear movement. Looks suspicious. No more messing around. <laughs> yeah! Ready? Ready? 
Where you going, guy? Finally gonna actually Okay. You seem to be having some trouble. Shellfish. Shellfish. All right, well, lizard bit probably covers us for one of the puzzles above. Not sure if the spiny shellfish will, but. Do you need the map? Okay, there's still a huge section over there we haven't covered, and actually, something we didn't look at over here. That's all. Just an empty space we hadn't stepped on. I can't go there. I see the orcas being derpy was just your game. Yeah, they seem to have some issues figuring out where they want to go some... T Hello? Okay, who did I train to fish? And are they still alive? It must have... Yep. All right, looks like Minimo's our fisher. And she even has the rod on already. Oh, really? Doesn't look like there's nothing there to me right now. Sorry, but I need to go to the restroom. Well, at least we know where the stuff is. Minimo provides or not. Mm, yeah. Crinkled fishing magazine. Looks suspicious. Fish favor creeks is barely legible. All right, well, everything we saw fall down, we have dealt with. I definitely would have preferred to have dealt with them up above. Okay, we got a metal pipe. Making sure that all the traps are getting marked in case I need to reference the map late. Is it, wait, really? That's it? Where are we? Okay. Well, if we're right about the lizard, then that lets us do something up above. I wonder if I should go back and... Alright, well, let's see. What's the cost of its uh, 39 though? So we get 10k points if we decide to do a uh, quick abandon back to base. Nobody else ages. I grab the couple of kids. Hey, Scary Crazy Butter Knife, how's it going? I'm debating if I basically want to spend 29,000 to not have people age. It's kind of what it boils down to. There you go, Sachika. Restroom acquired. The portable variety. Let's see. Jiggy's home works the coffee and bounced around Sekiro. Nice. How are you enjoying Sekiro? I had a lot of fun with it. Did a 25 hour marathon of it before uh, before I went on vacation, and then I haven't touched it since I got back. I think we're done here. We can take the lizard stuff up and see. Uh, Any died shock trap? No, they didn't even really hurt the enemy, so I'm not sure they'll actually hurt us much. Too bad you can't go into the water. I don't want to go into the water. Have you seen what's in the water? I'm glad that the game does not want me to go in either. Right now I'm just debating whether I want to uh, go grab the two kids 
at the cost of a chunk of points just so that we don't have to, uh... Because we'll definitely pass a day going up and it might pass another day getting home. Then get the kids. That's going to put them really far out of sync from everyone. They're already going to be seven days out. No, you know what? I don't need to score that badly, so... I'll pay it. Yeah, we've only seen what comes out of the water. We haven't seen what goes in, or what is in it, still. Oof. Poor Haruto. Well, first up to mark 14, but to be fair, I do tend to frontline him a lot. Oh, there we go. Die by slashing. Death by Dharma Orca. Died from being bitten. Good times. Which character needs to be a kid for an event? Haruto. Conveniently, he is one right now. And the Zen Mark 14. Oh, he got taken out at range. He was taken out by the fat guy. Death by acid. Death by fat creature. Death by Cleone Tongue. We could make a run for that event. There was several people who specifically needed to be alive, and Haruto had to be a kid. I think his was the only age that mattered. So if we get up there without anything going wrong, we could grab the event. I'm trying to think of how far in it was, or if it was actually... I think it's actually the one on the third floor. So we'd have to go up. It's going to cost us some time. That's a pretty decent hammer. I'm going to keep one shellfish just in case. And I'm going to grab the uh I'm going to grab the tomato. In case that is specifically what the, the other one meant. Uh, I kept the lizard sheddings on us, and the other shellfish we got, just in case. Uh, yes it is, Claymore. Bet someone has a shellfish allergy? Oh, yeah. We should find out who. Maybe when I've got a few more of them to spread around. Alright, I know there was stuff that required... There we go, that requires it. 54 attack. It's gonna have an element on it. Lizard mucus, air bladder, ice axe. I think we're good. Let's go ahead and do that. Yes, heat attack. Oh, power sling is doable, but we need monkey adhesive. Decent bow requires monkey adhesive. I guess I'm going to go let myself get slapped around by some monkeys. Well, I can... Oh, good! I can actually do this. Start using it now. Medieval gear. Okay, I'll have to figure out exactly what that does. We can make a couple of these. That's what I'm talking about. 21 defense, though? I better compare that against what I've got. It is child-friendly, though. Air bladder hat. Whoa, look at that. that seems absolutely disgusting to put on your head. Uh, yeah, there's a way to buff gear and weapons. We're just not using them. You do it with strengtheners. 
specifically uh, avoiding using it because I'm basically just holding them all to end game. How's an air bladder increased defense by that much? I feel like we're better off not knowing, and I feel like things are going to want to eat me if I wear this. No, actually, it's better than that. No decay resist, but better than those. I guess I will actually go ahead and make uh, the other one. Nice and sturdy. Yay, I'm going to wear bladders. All over, apparently. There we go. And that's all kid-friendly material. Well, to be fair, everything's kid-friendly to him, so... I'm going to put both of them in and put them on the back line because I want them both fighting. Okay, I got to know what the hell Medieval does exactly. Reduce damage taken and increase life. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay. I mean, that's that's bonuses. Uh, let's see. Mina was going to be frontlining, so... I think she can take a hit and live, potentially. I'm going to have to move Sachika up to the front line. I guess I'll give it to her. You can tell by the fishy smell. Mm -mm -mm. Good stuff. Yep. It's wonderful. My favorite. Alright, we can go ahead and get rid of the uh, couple of extra scale aprons now. Minimo stays in, she goes to the back. Oh wait, no, she stays at the front. I can't put Haruto at the front this time. Much as I'd love to. Sachi is gonna have to take front. I need to get their hundred uh I need to get their hundred attacks. That's gonna be awesome. Totally awesome. Shut up and eat your rabbit. Let's make sure the oops, let's make sure the best weapons are on the people at the front. Which basically they already are, so there, have a broom. Alright, I think that'll do. Oh boy. Taking kids down into all that. Uh, Alright, do we want to try and see the uh, the event at the top of Mashiro Garden Tower? Since it requires Haruto as a kid. Oh, nice thing, Star. Yeah, I know the one you mean. I still actually haven't had him show up on mine. Eventually, I'm sure. Maybe this will come in handy. Let's take this. All right, let's just gun it through fast and see if we can minimize uh, time passage. Excuse me. Take this. I'll hold it. Let's take this. We need this. Good right? God. Lucky me. No shortage of stuff is washed up here. Ten balls of water. I. Got it. I wonder how long those ten balls of water have been sitting there waiting for me. I have a feeling that we dropped that somewhere and it washed up here. Yes, combat is all real time. Ready? There we go. Broke the horn that time. You gonna run? Maybe this will come in handy. Got my horns. 
Oh, what was... Well, I saw something out of the corner of my eye and then that happened. Waiting for my chance. Let's see if we can get that off of her. Okay, good. Okay, whatever it was, it was mean in there. Let's take this. Maybe this will come in handy. Cleone Gouda. Well, apparently I got cheese. Where'd they go? Let's take this. Oh, yeah, well, we'll just gather all their stuff. Nice. Does this look useful? Oh, no, wait. Got it. One of those Maybe people might have needed to be in. alive for the, uh... God damn it. Well, those people might have had to be alive for the event. Come on, there's got to be something I can stack down. I hear movement. Waiting for my chance. Fortunately, it's just a goat. Get me my useful. stuff back. I'll take it. All right, there's gotta be more that I can stack down. Huh? What happened? <laughs> we we got AOE from the side in a doorway. It was a good shot on their part. Stack down there. Well, you know what? We really don't need to be carrying that much driftwood, I guess. Can I stack any of that? Nope, the meats are already stacked up. Okay, you know what? Monkey hair is mostly whoops, monkey hair is mostly used for uh, rope. I don't think we're lacking in any rope. I'm pretty sure, yep, there's more of that we can stack down. All right, buys us a couple more spots. Does this look useful? I'll take it. That'll stack. What is it? Lucky me. What is it? Monkey blood's good for blood sausage. And we don't have a lot of paper, so or cloth. We'll take that. Huh. No more messing around. Ready? Oh, there's Waiting an actual mimic chance. in here too. Okay, well, they're resistant to fire. God, if you miss one of those on this difficulty and the trap goes off, it'll basically just instantly kill someone in your party. Hmm, it's not coming our way. Waiting for my chance. Power. No Ready? You expect a nice, easy stroll and just get your friends dead. Yeah. Right? The, uh, the place is repopulated with some nasty shit! Whoa. Oh, fuck. He's... Damn it. It's Shadow Man creature. Okay, so that is something different. I was wondering what the hell that was. Alright, fuck the items. Waiting 
for Whatever he is, he moves fast. Really? You dick. Oh, son of a bitch. We could take that Waiting hit. For my chance. I want that damn arm. He won't Power. actually step I'm into room. Waiting for my <laughs> He's also taking a hell of a lot of hits. Waiting for my chance. Full power. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna eat that one. <laughs> Thank you, Minimo, for actually being able to take a hit. Waiting for my I want your arm off, damn it! That's right. This guy, right? Well, some people can take a hit. Never seen one of these before. Waiting for I'm gonna have to come back for all this stuff. Waiting that's for my that's a given. Power. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Holy fuck, Minimo. Concentrate retreat would be a Waiting legitimate strategy. He just no won't around. die. Yeah. To ashes. But you will. <laughs> what the fuck is this thing? No more messing around. Waiting for my chance. Full power. Yeah. Yeah. Right, that's over. Let's take this. Maybe this will come in handy. I'm just gonna come back for my stuff in a minute. Yep. Yep. Just gonna go home now and tidy people up. <sighs> Fix them up a little bit. That's going to cost us a few on the uh, mark counter. Is it time to cry in a corner? Well, fortunately, we have a whole lot of points available, so I'm, I'm not too concerned. Uh, poor Rio, though. Man. Mark 13 for you, buddy. He wasn't worth that much XP or anything either, so I'm kind of concerned about that. He might just be horrifying, and that's kind of it. He also mostly seemed to attack if I was attacking. Dark beyond that was harsh. <laughs> Thank you for the fist, Earl. <laughs> All right, death by ranged attacks, death from acid, death by shadow man creature, and damage from Cleone fluid. I mean, those are good resistances to have. Hey, Talon, how you doing? All right. Oh God, Zen Mark 15. What did I do to you, you poor bastard? Death by noxious stench. Death by heat. Death by Cleone's scarf. That's right, he got side slammed. Rinko Mark 13. Death by Shadow Man creature. Vile attacks. Look 
Okay, welcome back, Yuma. The Yuma Mark 13. Death by Shadow Man. File attack. Still, even just those should be useful for not dying instantly in the future. Man, even Sachika got spanked on that. Meet. Mamoru is the only person who hasn't hit Mark 10 at least yet. Tells you how much I use him. Noxious Stench. Cleone Scarf. Alright, I'm gonna go need to get my stuff and um, I think Minamo's gonna need to rest a tiny bit because she looks like she's in terrible condition. Uh, since we're now a small army of mostly children, I should probably go ahead and rest. Unfortunately, that means Minamo's gonna get up to uh, middle age. Same with uh, same with Mamoru. So maybe I should just knock them off right now. Nah, they can they can be the babysitters. I'm gonna go ahead and rest. Let's get our gene crossover bonuses. And uh, let's get everyone back up to being adults so that we don't have to worry quite as much when we go back there. There was no new Cleotic from that, I don't believe. Oh, well, we got Gouda. We'll see if that's a new one. Oh, hey. We actually reached our next uh, threshold. Oh, he said he's going to feed me something good, but I have a bad feeling about this. Hey there. Sorry for the wait. Made a special vegetable dish for beginners today. Give it a try. Yeah. I knew it. Just look at that happy smile on your face. I already told you I hate vegetables. See? After I went through all the trouble cooking it for you, the least you could do is try it. I told you. The other ones is kids. <laughs> oh, my hatred for vegetables is deeply ingrained in my genes. Even if I say it's good now, I'll just hate it again once I'm reborn. I agree. Maybe you should get food poisoning from a vegetable and die. Just munch on some rotten vegetables. Once you extend, you'll conquer your weakness. Wow. Zen with the incredible metagaming. All right, guys, it's time to kill him with vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't only flash my mind, but I'm beginning to think it may work. What the hell? Flashing your mind my ass. There's no way it'll work. Like hell, I'm going to kill myself by eating a rotten vegetable. I'm telling you. I put your grumbling and eat your vegetable. Damn it. Zen is still spirit animal. <laughs> I'll crumble all I want. Why are you trying to make me eat something I hate? Uh, There's always this or that with you. Listen here. What? No way, that's you. Uh, why don't you understand? Since we become friends, I just want you to enjoy the food I'm proud of. Now you of all people would understand how I feel. Hey. Uh, you think you can fool me with downcast eyes and your sad act? <laughs> <laughs> Not buying it. Yeah. Uh, you're just killing time and messing with me, aren't you? I'm never gonna eat any veggies. Yeah. Guess I failed again. Your vegetable hate is more severe than I thought. <laughs> uh, so you admit defeat? I gotta capture this on film. Yes, he did seriously just try to guilt trip him. Good morning. Where'd he get the camera? He's had the camera since the beginning, he just doesn't have... Any way to actually use it. There's no film. Good night. Alright, let's get the kids up to uh, adult level. Oh yeah. Oh god, this one is kids too. Let's see how this goes. Say Reiko, you used to work at a flower shop, right? Yes. yes, I did. Why do you ask? No. Yeah, it's just that I don't know any florists, and I've never really been to a flower shop. Yeah, it's a completely different career from mine, so I was curious what kind of work you did. That's true. No, in that case, I could go on all day. No, that's a very large portion of our lives. Please don't. First, my mornings began super early, since I needed to go to the market to buy that day's stock. And then I prepared to open the shop while cleaning and trimming the flowers. And I had to haul heavy things all year, so it took some strength. I had to ensure it was all fresh, too. I mean, depending on the season, I couldn't get any days off, like Christmas, for example. Plus, it's always the times like those when we got very difficult orders. I apologize. Oh, I'm sorry. Huh? Oh, what's wrong? Um... I just got carried away and talked too much. 
I always get like this when it comes to talking about work. I'm sure I'm boring you to death. To be fair, I can relate with that one. Work is what I mostly talk about. No. No, not at all. It's not because I'm an editor, but I really enjoy listening to people talk about things that they're passionate about. So, if you don't mind, I'd love to hear more about your work. Like why you decided to work at a flower shop, and what you like about flowers. <laughs> it really is beginning to sound like an interview now. So this is what you were like at work, huh, Haruto? Ah, uh... uh, oops. This makes us look like a couple of workaholics, huh? <laughs> what are you talking about, Haruto? This is normal. Shut up. That's true. I guess it does. By the way... What is it? Excuse me? I don't feel nervous anymore. Before, I would always get nervous whenever we were alone together. Oh, yeah. Now that you mention it, I'm not as nervous as I was either. <laughs> it seems we've both been making progress. Feeling attacked there a little bit, yeah. I think that's enough about me for now. I'd like to know more about your work. Why did you decide to be an editor? Do you enjoy what you do? <laughs> ah, sure, I'm happy to answer. Next time. Hmm. Miss Minimo, remember that time you said I can't be trusted? Uh... You mean when I said I've had to pick out of everyone, I'd be you? It's not like I'm that suspicious of you or anything. No. Oh, no, that's fine. But it did get me thinking. Aww. Is it really fine? It's kind of suspicious in itself. <laughs> <laughs> you're as sharp as ever. In any case, you're a police officer, right, Miss Minimo? Which means you must be better than the average person at spotting suspicious people. So what sort of features do you look for in a person to judge whether they're suspicious or not? Uh -huh. That's kind of hard to say when you lay it out like that. But a lot of it comes from instinct, so it ain't easy to put into words. Oh, but when it comes to police checkups, there's a manual for choosing what types of people to question. Hmm. I never knew that. So just for reference, what types of people are you supposed to question, and how can I not look like one of them? Aww. What are you going to use it as reference for? Oh well, put simply, it's anyone who seems out of place. People wearing camo or clothes that aren't fit for the season. People carrying big bags in weird places. It's just a manual, so again, I mostly rely on my own instincts instead. I see. Then has there ever been a time when you stepped a crime before it happened with your instincts? Uh-huh. That wasn't a big thing, but I did arrest someone who had a weapon on him after questioning him. He was a middle-aged looking guy with long curly hair wearing a tank top and sunglasses. <laughs> Is that a joke? <laughs> no, it really happened. Now you know you're the type I'd stop to question, so you'd better be careful. Mm -hmm. Then that means out of everyone here, I'm the one you're most likely to look at and talk to? What? That's not what I'm saying, you big lug. <laughs> you sure are adorable, Miss Minamo. I really don't get what goes on inside your head, Dr. Mamoru. Hmm? Oh god, these two again. Hey, Yuma, like, remember what you said the other day? You said you never had to hold back from buying something. Yes. Oh god, that's right, we're gonna get child, child Yuma for this one. Not so much the bouncy right now, Erm. But I know where to draw the line. Even if I want something, I would not ask for anything outrageous. Maybe I should have done kid version for the sip. Of course, if it was on the level of an overseas retired tank, I probably could have gotten one. The stuff you want is on a different level, huh? Mm. So, what did you want to ask? That's... Could it be about things that cannot be purchased with money? Yes, we have, uh, they said that there are, um, they found basically a huge selection of clothes at all ages for them. Yeah, I've been thinking. There are lots of people without money who are unhappy, but you, you have money yet you held back from getting that which couldn't be bought. That's what it seemed like to me. Hmm. Friends. Hmm? What? Yes. Love and dreams are achieved with money and egos. They exist upon a basic, a base of basic human necessities. Without those, it would surely be distorted in some way. But what about friendship? Is it not the one thing that can truly connect people, even if in the direst of situations? I have nothing to support this claim and I may just be romanticizing it, but... <laughs> Sachiki thinks you're right. Huh? Why is that? What do you think? Oh god, Sosugami. Ugh. 
Anyone who said you can't buy happiness with money just did not have sufficient enough bank account. Because now there's no money or things you can buy with it. But still, we help and care for each other, doing our best to live our lives together. It like, totally doesn't matter if you're poor or if my leg is missing, right? Right. It is not as if we had a choice. Well, perhaps now it all begins... Uh, how it all begins does not matter. Yeah! Yes, yeah, so I don't think you need to hold back anymore. Uh, I didn't specifically plan any of it, King Evil. And this is a blind run, so please don't talk about what's actually going on here. We've just been bunking to see what happens with the bond system. Nothing more, nothing less. Oh no! The mark of the bottom of the overlay is the uh, the mark of the clone. So basically, uh, we are on Haruto number fourteen, and uh, Sachika number ten. I do not know, but if there is a god, he may be quite a cynic. Uh, Where are you uh, going, Yuma? I'm sorry. I need some time to think. Oh, getting all friendly while we're on the same chapter where she's talking about how she's supposed to kill us. 